welcome to another episode of It's All Downhill From Here. We're super excited. We're on the outskirts of Handorf at the Bierenberg Farm. <laughs> this is our first stop off in the Handorf area, and uh, we've heard so much about this area. So, uh. the Bierenberg Farm. I just need ten of them. So I have my wristband and my uh, empty cardboard box that I will be filling with strawberries I pick myself from the strawberry fields here at Beerenberg Farm. This is gonna be awesome. You changed the moon. That is a lot of strawberries. Look how fresh these look. Ah, uh, oh geez, this is going to be expensive. <laughs> Ooh. What have we here? Hungry eye. <laughs> <laughs> are the best strawberries I've ever eaten in my life. Hands down. Hands up. <laughs> Can I have one more? <laughs> yeah, we, 
you've got a few to choose, so <laughs> yes, I'll give you one more. These strawberries are ridiculous. Now, I have every intention of filling up that box full of strawberries. And you are allowed to try, she said, two or three. Oh. Possibly four, but I won't eat more. Have the whole strawberry farm to ourselves. Oh, you gotta to come to this place. There's strawberry on my tooth. Yep. <laughs> I could see it. This is an unbelievable display of strawberries. You have no idea. Beerenberg Farm Handorf. Uh, get down here. Now. Now. Ah, uh, that'll do us. The beer and board, the beer and borg, beer and berg strawberry farm. Ah, uh, what a place to visit. Seriously, I'm gonna go bankrupt here. The taste of these make me never want to buy from the supermarket again. That was just downright impressive. We've also bought some burger relish, a heap of mustards, jam, did you get jam? Jams and our box of strawberries all came to around 15 bucks. So very reasonably priced, fresh as hell, here in Berg Farm. Highly recommended. Come back again. <laughs> Definitely come back again. Come on. And now on we go to the town of Handorf. Handorf. German. That was my German accent. And here I come, Handorf. Price here of food in South Australia, it's very reasonable. What a colourful little town. Bremen with life and character. Handorf. Get a hot dog? No, you eat too much strawberry.
need a pint. <laughs> Love the atmosphere. Some pub, German pub. Fresh German beer. One wheat beer and one original. German arms. <laughs> what a cool place. German Kransky sausage Cheers. in Handorf, South Australia. <laughs> Such a grubby eater. Oh, it's so fresh. It's like tasting Germany. Ah. Cheers, German. Thank you, German. Germany for Kranskys. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, 
Andorf has impressed us beyond our even wildest predictions and uh, we will certainly be back here. <laughs> Just randomly in South Australia, a German town, everything German, European to the shiznit. <laughs> Just a great place. Definitely, definitely highly recommended. Just quickly gonna check out the Cedars, the Hans Hayden Garden Studio and uh, Historic Establishment. Secret Garden Path of the Cedars. Ah. The grass is so soft. You can stay here for whole day. Yes, yes I can. <laughs> from my spinning. That's a bad idea. That damn tree sap. <laughs> nice place. Very friendly people. We only scratched the surface because uh, we have to fly out, uh, you know, soon. So we didn't really get to explore it as much as we'd have liked to. But what we did see was great, and uh, yeah, we'll definitely come back. Well, what an incredible trip. We've just downed a kilo of strawberries from Bierenberg. We're carrying our wines from Barossa Valley, and most of all, we're carrying an absolute buttload of awesome memories from South Australia. Brilliant place, we'll be back. We've only scratched the surface, and I can't wait to come back. Love it, Chels? Love it. <laughs> See you next time. Soon. See you next time. So thanks so much for joining us on the South Australia journey. What a great state. We had an awesome time there. A very underrated place. And what a finish there in Handorf. Beautiful, delicious strawberries. Great German country town sort of vibe. And 
finishing off at the Cedars, just out of Handorf with its beautiful gardens. I'm really pumped to show you the next episode where we head on another road trip out to regional Victoria. And this awesome place was somewhere that I really loved visiting as a kid. And it's right in the country, it's beautiful, and it will impress you, and it's called Bright. <laughs>